G'day humans, Chris Dead here. Got a quick unboxing for you today. We're having a look at the latest EcoFlow power station, the EcoFlow Delta 3 Plus. I'm gonna find out what's inside the box. I'm gonna give you my initial impressions and a few thoughts about the specs and where this sits in the power station universe. All right, let's go. I've actually done quite a bit of stuff with EcoFlow products in the past. I find them to be a really solid company in the power station space. They have branched out of power stations. They've got uh, like alternator chargers, they do fridges, they've got uh, solar panels, uh, they've got a lot of at home solar style stuff as well. Uh, and they're just, they, just, they just do really well made quality products. I've always been quite a fan. So this latest product, the Delta 3 Plus, is falls in kind of that mid-range category. So when you're looking at power stations, you've pretty much got three broad categories that they fit into. You've got the 500 watt range, which is uh, very much about day trips, picnics, going and charging a drone or a laptop for a day or something like that. Then you've got the 1000 kilowatt range, which is where this one sits, which is mid-range, which is going to, do your, it's going to be a weekender. And then you've got the 2000 kilowatt kind of bigger ones, which are going to then you know, kind of do a week camping, let you go off grid for quite a while, be a good house backup solution. And they do go bigger and there's obviously variations in between, uh, but that's kind of broadly what you're going to come across. And they all kind of sit around the same you know, price points and have similar features. So this one's going to cost you, EcoFlow is a little bit more expensive because the brand itself uh, has a reputation for quality. And so you're, this is retailing for $15.99 here in Australia. However, having said that, uh, there's some pretty good deals around, including EcoFlow member festivals. So if you become an EcoFlow member, which is free and you get rewards in it for buying products and stuff like that, but you also get access to these member festivals, special deals where they put stuff on sale. So I think this was down to $13.99 for the uh, Easter 2025 special. And I saw some other retailers matching that as well. So that could be uh, something to keep in mind. All right, let's have a look inside the box. See what we got here. Uh, now what, you'll probably see some of the stats on the front there. So one of the things that I really like about this one is that 1800 watts of uh, simultaneous power draw. So that, that, that's allowing you to plug in some pretty hefty stuff. And uh, it's also got a 3600, that's what the 3600 watts is referring to the surge. So that's how much it can surge up to uh, without you know creating problems. Uh, but that's gonna be your Sim, uh, simultaneous draw. She's going to find how many products you can fit into. I think it's got five different ports. Uh, and there's a whole EcoFlow ecosystem that you can get where you can get the solar panels. I really like the solar panels from EcoFlow. They kind of mold. They're really easy to pack up. They're really easy to carry and then they mold over surfaces to a certain extent. So you can throw them over a bonnet or something like that. Uh, and you can get, the, like, the, like I said, the alternator charger, things like that. All right. So pretty, Pretty typical box from what I've seen from previous EcoFlow products. A uh, bit unfortunate that it's foam. So a lot of guys are getting away from foam at the moment. Uh, I'm not sure if it's possible with something as hefty as a power station. Right, let's have a look. So we've got the actual power station in there. We've got two more bits of foam. And We've got this, which is going to have our power cable. Let's have a look. Ah, so that's interesting. So that's a 12 volt, uh, 12 volt jack. So you can connect those to your camping lights, for example. It's a typical use case for that. Now it's interesting that they've included that in the box. And that's our power cable. And what else have we got in here? All right, it's a uh, 12 volt as well. So that's for, your car, that's for your cigarette lighter in your car, basically. That's what you're gonna use that for. And there is some paperwork in here. Let's have a look inside. So EcoFlow does have an app, but not all of their devices are connected. I'm not sure about this one. I'm pretty sure this one is connected to the app as well. So that's you to monitor it all, but this is an LED screen on it. it should be. Yeah. All right, and in here we've got 
Uh, just a bit of information. I have some information about how you can daisy chain. So one thing about the EcoFlow system is that they allow you to basically add onto the single device with upgrade devices. So you can take a start with a thousand kilowatt and then add to it, which obviously you can just buy a 2000 kilowatt. They do do 2000, they do 4000. Uh, but uh, then you're always stuck with that unit. Like the 4000 one, which is the uh, Delta Pro 3, that's um, 50 kilograms, that's big. So the way, if you, if you do it more modular, then you can just take this if you're going for a couple of days and then take more if you're going for a week, you know. But we're going, we're going camping tomorrow and this is gonna sort us out for the weekend. Uh, just some information about safety and everything. So uh, this is a, a lithium ion phosphate battery in here. So that's the better kind. That's got a, a much shorter or a less dynamic thermal runway. So if things kind of go wrong, are less likely to go wrong with your lithium ion phosphate. But then it's got the X-Guard battery management system in there as well, that's basically just protects these things from uh, going boom. Let's see how long this cable is. Get an idea how much I've got to play with. And that is, I'm gonna say 1.2. So it's not too bad. You know, like I'm thinking here, power point in the wall, down the bottom, it's not amazing, but it's not too bad. I've seen, I've seen short, I've seen worse, I've seen longer, but, but that's not too bad. Okay, so let's have a closer look at what we've got here. Uh, we've got the four Australian uh, AC ports. We've got two USB-Cs and two USB-As. I can't see exactly because my eyes aren't good enough, and, but I believe it's 140 watt USB-C from my memory. And I don't know about the USB-As, but obviously that's fast charging. So that's gonna sort you out with one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, potentially simultaneous things at once, or charging, and uh, as long as it's uh, uh, under that 1800 watts. Let's get this off here. And we can change the buttons around for these new ones. Look, we've got these little subtle, soft ones up here. Uh, what's that, is that power? Um, oh, there you go. So it's got 23% out of the box. Nice, easy to read screen, as I'm sure you can see. So I'm pretty happy with that. There's been some interesting design quirks since I last used an EcoFlow. I can see it's got a little bit more of a hexagonal shape here on the bottom. It's definitely smaller than previous 1000 watt hour batteries that I can recall. Um, one of the great things that EcoFlow does, it has a flat surface on top. So this is just great in terms of like sitting a phone, sitting a laptop, sitting anything that you're charging. It also allows it to stack really easily. So if you're putting it in a four wheel drive, or whatever, you can just put stuff on top of it like that. Also makes it really easy to store in your garage. So I really like the nice flat surface and the handles at the end. Makes it portable. Weight's not too bad actually. Without um, compromising on storage space. Over in the back here, we've got our um, 12 volts DC. So that's your cigarette. So you can go, you can actually charge out of here, cigarette. Oh, come on. Jeez, it's all sealed. I think these are IP, IP68, I might be wrong about that. Uh, and then you've got your lights as well. And in here, you're gonna have your ability to charge directly from solar. So you can just go solar straight in, no need for an inverter or anything like that nowadays. Obviously you can just charge from the mains as well, which is what I'm about to do before this camping trip. And yeah, otherwise, and that's probably, that's probably where you daisy chain. So if you daisy chain into another battery, it'll be through that. And then you got the, uh, that's gonna be for you. This cable, and for your solar. All right. Oh, look at that, it plugs in like that. That's cool. It's a new design. I haven't seen that one before, so it goes out of the way. Yeah, it looks like they've, cha they've changed up the design just a little bit, made it a little bit sexier the sexy as you can make a power station anyway. So that's a quick unboxing of the EcoFlow Delta 3 Plus. I am gonna do a review of it. So make sure you keep an eye on the channel because that review is gonna go live soon. I'm gonna take it in action. I'm taking a bush, see how she goes. Uh, make sure you have a look at the channel. There's plenty of other camping equipment stuff up, power station equipment stuff up, lots of stuff on the channel for you to check out. I'm gonna put a link to the playlist uh, in the description below. So just click that and you can see everything it will come up for you. Uh, otherwise, I'm Chris Dead. Thank you very much for watching. Till next time, I'll check you later. Yeah.